Okay, this is going to be a quick video looking at some of the progress with meters. Um, there's still plenty to do. Uh, weeks of work probably still left to do, but thought I'd give you a quick uh, view. All the graphics, uh, courtesy of Ernst, OE3IDE. Uh, he's a whiz with all this graphics stuff, uh, and I'm not, so... <laughs> Um, it looks really nice. Uh, this is a Kenwood uh, TS890S lookalike, and this is a 7000 DLE. And at the moment, we've got uh, volts being shown here, and also um, S meter reading, of course. If I was to jump uh, to here. can see that it um, uh, is moving around no problem. So we're going to run some tests here on transmit. So uh, Is this frequency in use please? This is Mike Whiskey Zero, Lima Golf Echo. Uh, is the frequency in use please? MW Zero LGE going to be running some tests on this frequency. MW Zero LGE checking <coughs> okay, nothing heard. Uh, testing. MW0LGE testing. One, two, one, two. Uh, so, as you can see in transmit, um, uh, we've got full uh, activity of the meters. Going to put a uh, tune uh, signal out here now, 20 watts. So, uh, this red line um, is the power, of course, if we were to jump it to 50 thereabouts. Um, we can see it's sitting on 50 and it's on the 50 mark there as well. Um, we've got history uh, shown on these uh, on these lines. It's only shown on that one um, but uh, any of these could be configured to uh, show history. Um, and, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to detune, uh, detune this. So I'm going to put 20 watts out so we've got 20 here and 20 here. This is the SWR meter uh, line. This is the current, so we're just over 8 amps here, which is showing here. And this is the voltage um, compression and ALC are not uh, done yet. So I'm going to uh, alter the tune. Um, so as you can see, um, I'll bring the SWR up to about 2 to 1. And uh, if we uh, look at the needle, um, the cross needle is sitting roughly on two. And here we're sitting on two as well. I'm going to try taking it up to two and a half. Uh, here we go, two and a half. Which is about there. Or three. Like so. So, um... The cross needle uh, works. Uh, it's fully cal. So if we ha if we just set this so to have two watts of reflected power, and we look at the reflected power here, um, see that's just under two, and that's one point nine. So uh, yeah, it's uh, it's all seems to be tracking and calibrated nicely. Um, of course, uh, we don't really want to display all these all the time, all these pointers, so all these markers, so there will be a way to uh, select which ones are uh, active. You'll be able to click on the meter and cycle through, um, creating a grouping system, uh, so that's to do. Uh, there's a lot to do, actually. Uh, next on the plan is to... Um, is to actually uh, implement all the bar uh, meters, all these in one view, so you'll be able to see everything happening at the same time. Okay, uh, this is Mike Whiskey Zero, Lima Golf Echo, now clearing frequency. Uh, Test complete, cheers. Um, so, yeah, that's um, a quick overview of the meter system and of course they can be scaled <laughs> to uh, however big you want really um, so there's still stuff to do when it uh, shrinks right down these needles need to uh, get thinner and things like that so uh, 
yeah, I just thought I'd give you a quick view of that anyway. Alright, cheers.